Good everyone. My name is Graphics. Now we will be dividing a line AB, which is 165 millimeter, in proportion 3 is to 4 is to 2. What you do first of all is you draw your line in this direction. Let me see your 150 65 millimeter line right so if i do this i'll pick a point let me say point a this is a here and i'm going to measure 165 so from one to 165 will be somewhere around here at this point here i'm going for one south of 17 this 165 right so I am going to tick in that particular line so that is my 165 line now the next thing I'll do is that I am going to draw an angle at this point at any given radius so I can place my set square at any given radius it can be as it can be like this it can be like this it can be like this but let it let make it be what reasonable so if it's like this, I'll just draw a line, a short line. Can you see? This one, AB, is thickened, while here is what? Faint. Now the next thing I'll do is, it says into ratio what? Proportion of what? 3 is to 4 is to 2. I'm going to add all of them. So 3 plus 4 plus 2 is what? Is 9. That means I'm going to divide this line into 9 equal parts. So I'll take my compass, like this my compass, a reasonable radius, maybe 10, and I'll place it at this point, here, from A, I'm going to start marking. This is 1, this is 2, this is 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, eight nine it can be bigger than that if you want to you can take it at this extent so but allow it to be reasonable so the key word is you add whatever ratio is given you add them is that addition of the ratio you have that you use and divide this line if it is rich if you add them and you're having 12 you divide it into 12. now the next thing you do is you take your set square both of them the 45 degree set square Right, but five degrees set square and also the sixty degrees set square, or you take your ruler and any one, but just ensure that you have two different instruments. Maybe your set square, your ruler, or your set square, the two set square. Now what I will do is I am going to join the last point here. This is the last point, the ninth point, to the point B here, like this. I will join both of them together. Can you see that? Maybe let me make you see that very well. So I'm going to join the last point B. The last point B. And the last point 9 here. I'll join them. Can you see that? You may like join them. I won't remove this guy anymore. I will hold this guy down. Then I'm going to move, take the other set square, this is one, I would have placed it here, but if I place it here, I won't be able to rule. So I'll take it and I'll place it in the other direction, which is at this point here. Can you see? I'll place it at this point here. So in doing that, can you see, I place it here, maybe, let me make you see that very well. Place it at this point. Can see what I'm talking about? So it's at this point here. So you can see that it is tangential to this other one. So maybe like I place it there, I will hold this down, then I can move this. So when I'm moving this, so I'm moving this to the next point. I move this to the next point. Look at from this line, I move to the next line, which is this point here. You can see the point. Now draw. I'm still holding this one down, 
I'll move this to the next point. It is here. I'll move it to that line. I'll move it to, to the next point. It is here. I'll move this to the next point. It is here. I'll move it to the next point. It is here. I'll move it to the next point. It is here. I'll be moving them like that continuously to the next point. It is here to the next point. Which is here, and that is what I'm having. So, the long run, I've divided this into nine equal parts. If you count them, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, we we'll move back to where we are earlier, which is this. Now, if I've done that now, what I'll do is you say divide it into a proportion of um, proportion of. 3 is to 4 is to 2. So I'll start from A. This is 0. Point A is 0. I'll count 1, 2, 3. Because the first one is 3. So I'm counting 3. So 0, 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. So I'll take my compass, to that, my ruler to that point. So I'm going to place it there. And are we taking it? Sorry. I'll click in it. So I'll move to the next one, which is 4. So this one I've ruled will be my point 0. I'll move it to the next one. I'll count 1, 2, 3, 4. So I'll go to that fourth point. I'll click in that point 2. There's the next one. So the other one is what? It's 2. So I'll count. This zero line I rule is 0, so I'll count 1, 2. So this will be the final point. So I'll rule it. So what I've done now is I've got in my line this will be ratio 3 is to 4 is to 2. That's my ratio. So this is what we are having. If I zoom it, we are having this. This is what I just did. So from A to B was divided into nine equal parts, which is one. This is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And the ratio of this 9 equal part is 3 is to 4 is to 2. So I'll start from here, 0, I'll count 1, 2, 3, the first point. Of the point I've ruled, I'll take that point to be 0 again. This will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. I'll get the fourth point. From this point I've ruled, I'll call it 0 again. This is 0, 1, 2. So this is how we'll call it. 3 is to 4 is to 2. So I'll take in those points, those lines. So thank you very much for watching. We'll meet in our next video.